teacher, 29, faked brain tumor to trick schoolgirl into having sex with her. A teacher has been jailed for seven years for faking she had a brain tumor in a bid to trick a 13-year-old girl into having sex with her. Ryan Oaks, 29, was working as a high school sports teacher when she lied about her health problems to the youngster. Following the abuse, the young girl attempted suicide. Noakes, a top international women's rugby player, even shaved her head and faked seizures to make her fake tumor look real. A court heard she spun a web of lies by telling the girl she was terminally ill, her mother had died and that she was a victim of childhood abuse. After gaining the youngster's sympathy and trust the pair exchanged mobile numbers and when the girl was 15 they would meet for sex. Within the space of a year Noakes sent her victim more than 12,000 text messages. But after their relationship ended the pupil told police she had been manipulated by Noakes and feared she was targeting other youngsters. Swansea Crown Court heard Noakes was a talented sportswoman who had played rugby for Wales in the women's Six Nations rugby and football for Cardiff City. She was working as a sports coach leading lessons and after-school clubs at a high school in South Wales when she met the girl. Prosecutor Catherine Richards said the girl felt controlled by Noakes and gave up everything because she feared her teacher might die. In a victim impact statement the girl said, I really looked up to her and everything she told me she had achieved. When she told me she was terminally ill and had nowhere else to turn to I had nothing else in my mind but to be there for her. She controlled every aspect of my life. The court heard the girl became a short-tempered teenager who was confused about her sexual orientation. The victim also said she turned down the opportunity to represent her country in football because of Noakes' lies. She said, I gave up everything for her because she informed me she was so ill she might not be here long. When Ryan confirmed everything was a lie it hurt more than words can describe. She took everything from me. My dignity, my trust. I wouldn't wish the pain and suffering caused by Ryan on anyone else. During her trial at Swansea Crown Court, Noakes pleaded guilty to sexual activity with a child and inciting a child to engage in sexual activity. She also admitted sexual activity with a child while in a position of trust. Carolyn Reese, defending, said, she was a decorated sportswoman across the disciplines of rugby and football. She is somebody whose fall has been dramatic and hard. Jailing Noakes, of Neath, South Wales, Judge Paul Thomas Gusey told her she was a hero and role model to her victim. He said, she looked up to you as children of that age well because you were a successful sportswoman, an older woman and effectively her teacher. Judge Thomas said Noakes cruelly and methodically gained her support and made the girl touch her intimately. He said, the wickedness is the devastating effect on her young life. Man charged with men's lawyer of 100-year-old woman who died after street robbery Miley Billingham's dad pleads not guilty to her murder Three men claimed £117,000 by pretending to be Grenfell Fire survivors You took away her childhood. You took away her innocence. You took away her love of football. I believe that you were besotted and infatuated with her. Noakes, who cried in the dock, was handed a sexual harm prevention order will be on the sex offenders register for life and made subject of a restraining order, as well as being jailed. She was also banned from playing rugby for life. Noakes is a registered teacher with the Education Workforce Council and will face is being struck off at a later disciplinary hearing. More, Britain said to bask in 26C this weekend before rain brings plummeting temperatures more, body of schoolboy, 15 found in graveyard two days after he disappeared from home.